to, well, imagine if Obama's stimulus package when he came in in 2008 um, had employed 30 million Americans right off the bat. That would give you an idea of what the WPA was able to do. The Works Progress Administration was just the best known of the many New Deal Public Works agencies, doing everything from building sewers and airports to sculpting and painting murals. And what I've learned by working with the Living New Deal is that to create a healthy individual and healthy society, you should have a beautiful one, as well as a utilitarian one. The New Deal Public Works agencies created much of the infrastructure which we use every day without thinking of it. Think the Tower Bridge, actually, that gets you across the Sacramento River and is such a magnificent gateway to Sacramento. That's New Deal. Probably all the parks in Sacramento were improved by the WPA, and many of the street trees, which are such a glory in Sacramento, were almost certainly planted by the WPA. But in the case of New Deal art, they did something different. When you look at the murals and the sculpture that they did in the schools and especially in the post offices, you see what they did was to glorify the work, the dignity of labor of ordinary Americans. It wasn't just that they won the war, they actually got us out of the depression at the same time too. So the, the purpose of the Living New Deal is not only to rediscover what they did for us, but to remind us that it could work again.